Oh gosh, y'all. So you have to forgive my messy brain because it's a mess. Um, I wait inside. What am I talking about? It's, it's crazy here. It's crazy out there. It's crazy in here. It's crazy. I wait inside and I lost 1.6. So on the week of my 30th birthday and with Thanksgiving, I lost 1.6. Shut up. I know. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, let's get to some fun stuff. Let's talk about things. I'm at um, 57.5 pounds lost. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm sorry. I'm a wet mess. Okay. I, I, I know. I'm so discombobulated. Remember my whiteboard when I started this and I would organize my thoughts? I don't even know what happened to all that. I just... It's gone downhill, kids. I don't know what to say. Okay. Enough with that. Enough with the okays. Okay. Lost 1.6, 7.5. Bigger news than that. I mean, I care. And, of course, my goal is to lose 110 pounds. And I am more than, more than halfway there. But, um, that's not really my big news. I have been jogging. Since that day that I made that video that said, hi, I jog, I have been jogging. I am going to the gym and jogging. Serious, okay? And I went today, and today would be my fourth time going. And I did 20 minutes, separated by, I, I walked for seven minutes. A fast walk, too, not like a leisurely walk. <laughs> like a walk that would have, like, flipped me off the back of the treadmill if I didn't keep up. So I, I walked. Um, and then I jogged for 10 minutes. And then I walked for five. And then I jogged for 10. And then I walked for five. And then I kind of on and off, jogged, fooled with the, I, I jogged, but I also fooled with the, oh, the incline, so it wasn't all jogging after that point, it was also trying to figure out what else the treadmill does, but, uh, um, okay, I'm a short person, and I think I banged the hell out of being a short person, but you really got to watch it because you're like, I'm like running and there's like this super tall guy next to me and, and he's totally nice and, and like, I don't feel like an ass beside him, which I was really worried about feeling like an ass because these people are at the gym looking all hot and I'm on my way there, but I'm not there yet. Or maybe I am a little, but like, whatever. Um, but you know, like they know what they're doing and I'm just figuring it out. And, um, He was like, like his leg, like his stride was as long as the treadmill. And I'm like running up in the front, just trying to keep myself from flying off the back. So, yeah. So I jogged again. And it, it was like, like, I've, like, my friend was like, you can breathe. Like, yeah, I can breathe. I can breathe. And I'm not saying that I don't physically feel it. I mean, I, I sweat and it feels great. And I lose myself in the run and it's really amazing and sometimes I'm running more than jogging and sometimes I'm jogging um so it kind of like alternates but I mean I love it I love it I love when I'm it blows my mind I swear I, I just tweeted this but I feel like like I'm scared like I'm gonna wake up and it's not gonna be there anymore and I'm not gonna be able to do it or or I'm gonna wake up and it's gonna be a year and a half ago, and I'm not going to be able to walk again. Like, I'm so scared of that day coming, of waking up unable to walk, which is what happened a year ago, a year and a half ago. And, and then I think that's not going to happen. Like, I've been there, and I've done that, and I can jog. A year and a half later, I am in better health than I was in when I graduated high school. And... I'm never going to be there again. And even if I wake up in pain so horrible that I can't move, that will be like that. Because it will it, it will get fixed. I will not allow myself 
to be taken down by that. And that's just, I, I don't know, like the fact that I can say that and mean it and believe it is amazing. And I feel like when I'm jogging, I, I'm like, I'm, I feel like I'm going to cry. I feel like when I'm jogging, like, like that just, like I feel like my life it is just unfolding, like my destiny and like what I'm supposed to do is just unfolding in front of me. And I'm not saying like the answers come rushing, but I feel like they can. Like I'm alive and I'm living and I'm not scared and I don't have anxiety. I'm just on the treadmill and I'm running and I'm rocking out to whatever music I have in my head. And it's like, I feel like I'm unlocking myself like from all the things that ever bound me. It's crazy and I don't know where it's going, if it's just going to wind up with me being really thin and really happy or if it's going to turn into something, but I feel like I'm opening something up and it's amazing. It's amazing. And I know I, I probably come across as kind of stuck on myself a little. And I, I, it's not that. It, it's like, I mean, I'm not under any illusions. But I tell you, it's... I, I can't even express it. Like, I'm so proud of myself. And I'm so thankful for every person in my life. Every influence. Every thing that has gotten me to this point and allowed me to achieve this and I'm proud of me I'm so proud of me and it, it's like one of my friends is like you're going to the gym like don't you feel like like a fat person just sitting there next to the skinny girls look I'm not saying they're not rocking better bodies but I have worked hard and I am working hard and I am proud of, of me and you know what I've shocked myself I'm sure I shocked other people I can run, and I can jog, and I'm not in that bad a shape. Like, I've really whipped my ass into shape, and that's amazing, and I'm just so excited by it. I'm, I'm so happy. I don't even know. I don't even know. <laughs> I just rattled on and you probably turned off the video already, but I don't know if y'all know who Marcellus Wiley is, but he, um, he was in the NFL and, 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 and he was defensive end. I think he played for, I know he played for the Cowboys. I know he went to the Pro Bowl. I think that was in 2001. I'm pretty sure he played for the Bills, the Chargers, the Cowboys. Ah. Bills, the Chargers, the Cowboys, maybe the Broncos? No, damn, I can't believe I can't remember. But anyway, uh, it, this is why. I'm about to tell you why I can't remember because I'm like thrilled to death. So he's my all-time crush of all time. And um, I've known that for a, a while. But um, the other day, I tweet, I Twitter, I tweet. Um, I don't really promote it. It's just like, I'm, like if you ever go by my blog, it's at the top of my blog. It's like... You know, so that if I haven't put up a new post in a while, there is new information up at the top, even if whatever. But um, a lot of it lately has been, going to the gym, I jogged, going to the gym, I jogged. So anyway, I'm sitting on the couch and I'm watching TV, I'm watching ESPN, love, love, love ESPN. Okay, so I'm watching ESPN and, and it's uh, Mike and Mike in the Morning, I think is what it was, that was on. And Marcella Smiley was on the show and I... Him. So, totally, I totally alt for him, okay? So, I'm watching, and I decide to tweet that he is my all-time crush of all time, because it's the truth. And N-O-M-G, you guys, O-M-G, like, like, O-H-E-M-G-E-E, -E -E, okay? Craziness! He reads it, and tweets back. Oh snap! What? Are you serious? Oh my God, Marcella Wiley! If I would have known for one minute that you would find my 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 online nonsense, 
I totally would not have named myself Little Fat Me. I would have called myself, like, Little Sexy Hello or some shit like that because, hello, I cannot believe it. Anyway, he's following me now. So if you're not, you're obviously not as cool as he is. You better get over to my blog, littlefatme.blogspot.com, and follow me on Twitter because that's what Marcellus Wiley is doing. What? What? I'll say it again. My all-time crush of all time, Marcellus Wiley, is following me on Twitter. Ah! Oh, oh dang. <laughs> okay. So anyway, that was it. That was my, um, my crazy emotional, hello, I'm still jogging. I think I'm going to join a gym. I'm going to join a gym. Oh, my God. I'm going to join a gym. And I'm kind of, okay, now this is just the plan like one, you, between you and me, right? So it's a secret. Um, I'll get closer because it's a secret. There's a little part of me that, like, I'm going to join this gym, right? And I'm going to jog. And that's all great. And I really love jogging. I love jogging. This tiny part of me that is thinking that I might start my day with. I don't want to be all like, ooh, ooh. But I think a little bit of muscle. Like, I don't want to be Madonna. That's a little bit too gristle. But, um, yeah, a little bit of, a little bit of, mm, mm, in the, yeah. Oh my god, I know! I'm so excited! Okay. There you go. <laughs> and, uh, this is my weigh-in. 57.5 pounds down in 28 weeks, bitches. I keep saying, I keep dropping word bombs. I'm sorry, but it's so exciting. It's hard not to let it go to that level. I will be making more videos and seeing you all, and... And thanks for being a part of it, because truly, every aspect of it, I'm excited by.